Gracias por darme la fortaleza para superar mi adicción. Habrá que reconstruirla por completo. Eclipse. 25th of December, 1603. It has been four days since we turned away from the city. We traveled in silence and in circles, guided by a confusion of grief, relief, and celebration. Lopez and I exited the jungle and landed in a clearing under the gaze of several faces carved into the side of This roughly drawn sketch shows St. John repelling a demon attack. Perhaps they plan to have this as one of the frescoes in the mission. John, son of Zebedee, one of Jesus' apostles, also called the beloved disciple. He and his brother, James, were known for their impetuousness and temper. The wall seems fragile. There might be something hidden behind this. Have a look. The sun will be darkened and the moon will not give its light the end of days. Brother de la Cruz appeared one day, emerging from the jungle, breathing new life into the mission. There were just the three of us when he arrived, and Sister Dorothea had been ill for many weeks. He and his associate began to work that first day. Tardaremos eternidades. ¿Cuántos años? Stone faces weep as Jesus creeps along the dolorous path. Too many died. More will still, and more will still. Un paso a la vez. Un día a la vez. Twenty-sixth of December, 1603. Lopez woke me, having already prepared a Spartan breakfast. This is where we were meant to be, he said, a cold determination in his voice, so very different from how he acted just the day before. The door closed and a silence settled, so great and so vast I held my breath for fear of breaking it. Lopez turned to me, his eyes wild, a smile screwed across his face.
The others are worried that Brothers de la Cruz and Serrano will not return. I have so far maintained they will, that they always have. But in my heart... This cross, it looks like it's from the 17th century. Under his wings, you may seek refuge. Jonah, those two Bible quotes. The sun will be darkened, and under his wings, you may seek refuge. What does it mean? That's it. Look for a heron and an eclipse. There's a whole mural under here. Cruz, the true cross. Is that what I think it is? The silver box. It's unmistakable. Jesus takes up the cross. These are just stations of the cross. But there's a bunch missing. Before 1600, there were only seven. This could date back to the time of Lopez. This is one of his clues. Yeah. It's the kind of thing he does. All right. Let's see if we can find a cross lying around here somewhere. When we find the box, how do we get the key back from Dominguez? We'll find a way. Found something? Yeah. Jesus takes up the cross. Help me lift this. Looks like a long way down. Let's see where this leads. Station two. Jesus falls the first time. There's an inscription here. Ambulate dum lucem habitis. Walk while you have the light. somewhere. Walk while you have the light, so that the darkness may not overtake you. Sounds like a hint. Or a threat. This looks like the Virgin Mary. Station 3. Jesus meets his mother.
That mirror looks dusty. I'll give you a boost. something. This must be Station 4. Yeah. Let's have a look at these frascos. Look, someone else got close. He wasn't as lucky. There's a woman in this one. Is that what I think it is? The stations of the cross again. But with mummies. Isn't this sacrilegious? Not necessarily. They could have been paying the ultimate homage. Or they were just sick. This must be Station 6. Looks like a church. These ones are posed like monks. Uh-huh. 